Make sense so a couple things you saw how I caught him right he hit and I brought him up that takes all his momentum away from him we'll talk over a couple other things over here we're gonna hide in the grass the dogs are gonna find us we're gonna flee on foot kind of as much as you can run in a bite suit and then the dogs gonna get their bite so what are, what are these guys doing today? They signed up to decoy. Once he's on the bite and we get to you, there's a sequence. It's gonna be something along the lines of suspect stand still. The good news is you can't screw up, right? You volunteered for this. Are you instilled with an overriding sense of confidence? Oh yeah. I wouldn't be, but okay. <laughs> you want the helmet? You should have it or no? Yeah. As long as you protect your head. Yeah, I guess I'll take it. <laughs> um, I'm Zach Madden. I'm a community service officer at the Wasa Police Department, and today I volunteered to get bit for some reason. I'm Wade Shinoski. I'm also a CSO for the Wasa Police Department, and I also volunteered to get bit for a day. I mean, there's, I think, a couple nerves today, but... Yeah, it's, definitely. It'll be interesting. I actually think that Ethan's going to take it like it's nothing. I don't know. I, I'm nervous, so... Sean, uh, yeah. we saw you in the last video with uh, Xanto, but yep. some some things have changed, haven't they? Yeah, just a little bit. Um, we're going to be getting out uh, our newest canine, uh, Canine Loki, or as I call him, Loki. Um, but you'll see in a minute here, he's not so Loki. And you can tell he's ready to work here, so we're going to go get him started here. So the first thing I'll do is I'll make my announcements. You in the field! Wausau Police Department with a canine! Surrender now, or I'll release my dog, you will be bit! Final warning! Find him. Good watch. Watch up. You know, for his first time back here um, during training, he did very well. Um, as you can see, during our first pass, he had a change of behavior and uh, started going upwind where he found the suspect and engaged on the bite. So he did awesome work. Any equipment? Canine, you're out in the field, come out, do it now. Rex! Go! 
just walk away, don't look at him. Are you injured? No. Get him out of the suit, guys. Yep, you won. Come on. Come on, you won. Oh, I heard the dog that time. You feel him? Oh, yeah. Where'd he get you? Center back again. I kept running with this one. Get a boy! Boy, get a boy! Told ya, dude. Get a boy! <laughs> I'll be honest, uh, I, I, did, told I didn't believe you. <laughs> no, these, these dogs are in, absolutely insane when it comes to tracking stuff or, or articles and stuff. You want to do the next straight now? Uh, I will do the next straight now. But all I need you to do is walk into that woods, just into the woods and find something to like lean against or hide behind. Stand still! Aster! Loves! 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 Good boy! Good boy! So this is canine Loki. Um, he's from Bulgaria. Um, he is 16 months old and we just finished training in the middle of June. Um, so he's just a puppy and just getting started here with Wasa PD. And um, he's trained for tracking, uh, drug detection, officer protection, um, and apprehensions. So building searches, things like that. Generally, um, we're not comfortable with the dogs and they're not comfortable with us. Um, for probably between six months and a year. Um, because I've had a previous dog, it'd probably go a little bit quicker. Um, we did bond pretty quickly during school. Um, so he's pretty used to um, the things that I'm gonna do. Um, it's just me getting used to um, how he's gonna do his work. So the biggest thing is uh, going from a German Shepherd to a Belgian Malinois. Um, they have probably about triple the energy um, as a German Shepherd. Um, so it's constantly keeping him busy, keeping his mind busy. Um, he's still in puppy stage two, so that meant a whole lot of uh, chewing in the kennel. Um, so I went through and I had to what I call Loki proof everything. Um, so if it wasn't bolted down or metal that he couldn't chew, um, he chewed it up. So um, I've been doing some repairs around my house while that's been going on. So. <laughs> Yeah, um, so I'll continue training with them the best that I can. Um, I'm out with an injury right now, so um, I just do what I can uh, right-handed with them at this point um, until the left one's healed up, and then we'll be hitting the streets here fairly soon, hopefully. Yep, good boy. Yeah. He's definitely a lot more social uh, than Xanto was. Xanto was kind of his one, he was a one-man band, and he liked to do what he liked to do, and. But Xanto's a lot more family friendly and dog friendly and stuff, so um, he likes to cuddle, that's for sure. But he's a little too hyper for that. <laughs> there you go, you got yourself a close up. 